Maya. Who can do it? Are it. You can breathe. You can win. You can cry. Hello. Good evening. Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead. We are trying to catch up now, as you can probably tell. Power through yeah. some. We're trying to get so caught up where when the mid-season happens at episode 8, we can get that out on time. So that's the plan, that's, ain't that's it? The, that's the plan. Yeah. So we will do it. We promise. We'll try our best. So last week... Last week? It wasn't even last week. Last episode... Last episode. What happened? Rick has basically given in to the fact that Negan is like Mr. Big Boss Man. Yeah. And we've... But I, th I still think he's cooking up an idea in his head, like yeah, a plan yeah. or something. For sure. A little bit, and we had a very emotional scene when he was talking to Michonne about Judy. Yeah. And being shamed. Yeah, and I didn't include that. I'm really sorry about that because we, we did mention quite a bit in that bit, and I was rushing, trying to edit it to get it up online before I got too busy, and just forgot about that scene, and I was just like, oh, fuck it, I'll just, I'll just upload it like that. So, what I'll do is once I've edited this and uploaded it, I will then upload that scene with our reactions or comments in it. It won't be much, but because you guys wanted it, I'll upload that on its own, mm -hmm. um, so you're not missing out. I mean, I was <coughs> proper stupid. I can't believe I forgot about it, but I did. Human error. Sorry, but I'll get it online for you, just so you know. It was a long episode, but there was a lot going on. Yeah, it was one of those like it wasn't slow and it wasn't fast paced. It was yeah. like it was like medium the entire way through. Yeah, it was just yeah. right. It was a constant average, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it was all right. And yeah, we just kind of realised that things like the people that weren't there for the whole Negan's introduction, or yeah. the other people yeah. like Sandria, kind of don't quite get it. Like Spencer. Yeah, they're just, kind of, they're just kind of like, oh, this is shit, we don't like this, we should do something about it. Even though, like, Rick's there going, look, they will kill people, and I don't want that to happen. Yeah, they didn't have to see Glenn and Abraham be killed, and they haven't seen what they're doing to Daryl, and in fact, nobody's seen what they're doing to Daryl. Especially the way that he conducted up to himself the yeah. during the episode. I mean, I think w what it is, and I said this, they've fucked him up so bad that he's not speaking. What I've also realised, when I was editing it back, Dwight said, you can have the bite back, just say the word, and that means say you're Negan and you'll be a, you'll be us. Yeah. You will be one of us. You won't be locked up in a cell. Have, you can have your back, you can have your rights back, essentially. Yeah. Just yeah. about. But he's not saying it. Because he's not saying Negan and he's not saying he is Negan, he's not saying anything because they've broken him. Right. But he's being so stubborn like he's not saying Negan because he doesn't want to be part of Negan the Saviors. Yeah. And I think that's pretty strong. But I, I do think he's going to break eventually and it's going to be sad. This is episode Five. Yes. Now we'll get onto it. Now we will get onto it. Oh yeah, because Maggie went to Hilltop. Oh yeah, I was going to say Maggie did disappear. Didn't yeah, she? somebody told us about that in the comments. Thank you about that. Yeah, went to Hilltop. Welcome back. Oh, yeah, it's got a doctor, haven't it? So. Mm. That makes sense. Dr. Carson, here at Hilltop Colony, you've been asleep for a while. Suffer from the condition of Brevdeal placenta. It's a separation of the placenta from uterus. It's unusual this early, but uh, it can be caused by trauma. Possibly the bruises on your abdomen. Did I? Uh, Lisa? Uh, no. Oh, thank God. The separation was small. Baby's heart rate is normal. Yeah, Good news. Very good news. Now you need to take it easy for a few days. That's happy. Glenn's gone, unfortunately. But they're still alive. They're still part of him alive. Take care. I like the hilltop, but I still feel like it's just. It's just not prepared enough. It's kind of like an Amish living, isn't it? Yeah. I think, I, I want to know, like, obviously, the saviors collect from the hilltop and the kingdom. Yeah. And Red Hope and, and now Alexandria. I'm just wondering who else they collect from now. I reckon there's quite a few people. I reckon. There's got to be. They've got all that power. Yeah. When they've got power like that, they can throw it around and they can 
take as many people on as they want. That's the watch that Herschel gave Glenn. Mm. Pocket watch. It's so sad. It's weird to see Sasha sad. You're going to be right. Sasha's such a strong character. She's had her moments though. Oh, that's true. Aww. This friendship's getting real cute. It's nice to see you up. Flowers. Jesus! I wish you could have been here. Hey, Mark. Hey, Mark. I'll take them back. Yes, I, I know what you meant. So it's the... No, it's not. Maggie is pregnant. Well, that's her mistake. Wait. Oh, what? dickhead. Sasha would have gonna rip oh, his balls he need out. A, he needs fucking punching. He's so selfish. I know he's looking out for his people, but fuck me. Like, two more people that need help is no fucking problem. They're not gonna go in and completely kill all of Hilltop because that's some of their, like... <coughs> That's where they get their fucking <coughs> resources. <coughs> oh, what a dick. Oh, man, I forgot he existed. It was such a bad Me too. God damn it. <coughs> Why does it have to be dick and good guys as well? As... Oh, no, it's so painful. Just to come with us. So I was going to be here for Judith. There's people who want Somebody can't play darts. We'll only be gone a few days at the most. We need supplies. They're going to be coming back soon. Is this how it's going to be now? Yes. It is. You know that. See you in a few days. Oh, she's she's going. Going. That perception. Oh, oh shit, God. yeah. <coughs> it's a bit hard as a shit. Yeah. I'll uh, meet you downstairs. I did forget that it could have been called. <laughs> 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 Change your bandage later. Be nice to Olivia. He needs his hair chopping, he does. He's, Fucking he hell. Does. He's getting pretty long. Looks like a girl. I'm sorry. I liked him. He was one of the only people I'd ever met who could say things that could make you smile and wince at the same time. <laughs> so true. Yeah. Very true. She's got no fear, that girl. No. It's a bit stupid. It is a little reckless, isn't it? Mm. I mean, she, she's proven that she can handle herself. So I think if she ran into something, she didn't think she'd think Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Stop. 
What? Oh, he's such a ninja. I love him. Oh, I love Jesus. Wow! Yeah! Boom! Yeah! I love Jesus. <laughs> it's awesome. Okay, so he hasn't done this. It must be Negan. It must be Negan. Oh shit, not It's got to be Negan. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Why aren't the gates closed in it? Like, I, I, I reckon Negan's guys. Yeah, oh shit. Right, so, oh, Maggie. <laughs> Maggie's on it. <laughs> Oh mate! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Bye -bye. <laughs> Think about that. That's epic. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I actually feel like if Jesus died, it'd be the saddest thing. I think it would actually. I, I think for, for, for a minor character, I'd be actually really sad. Ah, so music's quick on the car. I see. That took you a really long time. To I know, I know, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm pretty sure they did, did they say the music's coming from a car? <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> Probably just missed it. <coughs> no, That's not. shit though, I can't believe they even do that. I watch. Although the, the finger thing was quite a, a nice evil touch. <laughs> You're not in charge, Jesus. I am. I'm the one has to look after the safety of this place. What are you telling me you want to call the plays? After all this time? And you time? did fuck all yesterday. After I set the table here? No, oh, shit. fuck. They'll do what they find you here. Jesus, get them in the closet. Great. Go, get in there now. You don't move, you don't speak, and maybe you'll get out of this alive. Oh, shit. shit. Negan doesn't have come down hard on things, does he? Oh, yes, it is. He's so awesome, he's such a great actor and character every time. He just plays batshit mental, he does it so <laughs> well. He is. So. What could you possibly have found that put that much of it? Oh, oh my skate. god! <laughs> Oh my god, if they become like a roller skating, like zombie fighting duo, that would be the coolest shit. That would be so cool. And I wouldn't even put it past this show because I've got a fucking tiger in here. <laughs> like. <coughs> <coughs> oh. It's okay, Carl. I'm the same. Some of us just aren't built to move like that. He also has one eye missing. I don't think that helps. <laughs> <laughs> What's my excuse then? <laughs> you just shit. <laughs> no, it's the little things, isn't it? The little bits of happiness, that's really nice. <laughs> Trying to greet every single one of them. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I just don't remember all your names. <laughs> There's so many of you. I think you know what it means. It means we need to talk! I would be shit in my pants if I was Gregory right yeah. now. Like, he's just the kind of guy that would be so hard to lie to, because I'll just cause I'll see you right through it. Next we'll leave here is. Oh, oh no. He's gonna, sh he's gonna get him out, isn't he? What a dickhole. Oh, look at Jesus' face. No! No! Oh my god. Gregory is such a prick. <coughs> Nothing about that. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Just like, off, gets off the bottle, takes the box. Slide that one back in. 
Sorry, I shouldn't ask. You want to slide that one back in. Period. Is this the kind of person I wouldn't ever want to deal with? Because they're this constantly in control of the conversation. Yep. yep. It's huge. And I won't forget it. I really, really appreciate this. Thank you. You just can't tell how genuine any of his Now, we're going to go through the place and take half of everything you have, but only half. Functional family. So we will be. Yeah, bitch. Through this. Get told. We play nice. They play nice. Say, so dear, savers can actually be quite reasonable. He didn't. He didn't. Watch. Doesn't need to be left out in the rain. This is our home now. So you'll learn to start to call me by my name. Not Marcia, not Dear, not Honey. Maggie. Maggie Ree. Yes, babe! Fucking love ya! really good because like <coughs> I, don't, I really don't know because obviously Carl could get himself into some serious trouble because he's such a stubborn cunt he <laughs> like, really is he's so stubborn but I think Jesus is the person that could break that out of him a little bit do you think I think he could I hope so because Jesus so otherwise he'll just get himself into some, some right shit yeah Jesus is the kind of person that the kind of character that can uh, is able to be sensitive but also be stern mm. with people yeah, it's just a nice guy, like, and he means well. I feel like Carl will see that and then listen to him because Jesus is full of wisdom. Yeah. And he's a fucking ninja. He so. is an absolute ninja. I love him. That was such a great episode. I really, I really enjoyed that. It was. Yeah. It, it probably made me smile and laugh sometimes, even though there were some really crappy bits, like some uh, things that weren't brilliant in the storyline. But I don't know. It just. It was fun. It was just fucking great. It was just funny, there were some happy things in there, there was some tense bits, and it's just kind of like, I've heard a lot of people saying, oh, the Negan storylines get really boring, but I just, I don't know, I'm really enjoying it. Because mm -hmm. obviously it's, it's showing the life of what Negan and the saviors do, how people cope with it, and something's going to happen eventually, so just, so just wait for it to happen, because yeah. something's going to happen. I just fucking love Jesus, and I really don't like Gregory, I think he's a dickhead. Yeah. The saviors are such good villains. They're amazing. They're, they're genuinely like great people down to the point. Do not fuck with them. Because <laughs> they will put a bullet through your head fast yeah. and you can save Lucille. <laughs> That's true. I mean, I must admit, I, I actually kind of miss Negan not being in it this episode. Yeah. I did miss his him. His charisma. His very strange character. But then, 
I can't even remember his name, the moustache guy. I can't remember his name. Shit. I just, I just, I'm just gonna call him Steve because that's his real name. Steve yeah. Og. Steve. <laughs> Steve's character, please let me know what it is because I have the worst memory of names. Um, his character came in and he was, he kind of brought that mental personality mm -hmm. like Negan has, but he is actually fucking crazy. Yeah. Negan has some fun. He's just fucking crazy. Yeah, like ne Negan's like a very specific kind of crazy. Yeah, he is. He's like egotistical and mm -hmm. almost sort of a god complex kind of thing. Yeah. Whereas this guy is genuinely just batshit. Yeah. Yeah, you can just see it in his eyes. Yeah. He's just like, sorry. Yeah. Did Did you understand? <laughs> he is, and you just he's not, you don't know if he's being sarcastic or if he's actually meaning what he's yeah, saying. Yeah, he's like, like that genuine. Is really a pre Mind you, Negan's like that as well. Yeah. It's like I'm really. Really appreciate that. It's just like, do you though? Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? I just want to put that back from my head. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't really know what else to say because when it's a good episode, it's just a fucking good episode. Yeah. When it's a bad episode, you can say a lot of things about it and how you didn't like it. But when it's a good episode, it's just like, you I just got that feeling in your stomach and your heart where it's just like, that was a great episode. I loved it. <laughs> your stomach and your heart. Yeah. And it's like, Ooh. <laughs> no, yeah, that was a great episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, we'll try and get the next ones out as soon as possible. And as we said before, as target is to be on time with episode eight for the season finale, uh, mid-season finale. Come back for oh, the next no. episode, and uh, subscribe to the channel. Give it a like, give it a subscribe, give it a favorite, whatever you want to do. Share it. You know, head over to my Facebook page, my Twitter to keep up to date with um, any announcements or things that I need to tell you, uh, because you guys complain a lot, and I don't do videos for updates because. I use Slax's camera because I don't have one. I know, a YouTuber that doesn't have a camera. It's pretty fucking stupid. But it's true. <laughs> so it is a stupid truth. <laughs> it's a stupid truth, but... I don't do them on the camera because... I hate doing vlogs. I can't vlog. I don't really know what to talk about. And that's why I'm rambling on now. So it wouldn't be very interesting. So that's why I do Facebook updates that go to my Twitter as well. So please, head over there and you will 100% see every update that you need to know. And so, we end this episode here, oh. episode five. Episode five. Um, see you later, alligator. In a while, fuck it out. In a bit, dog shit. I've never heard that one. Bye bye. See you later. Hello! <coughs> Good evening. Welcome back to a very, very late episode of Reactions and Reviews to The Walking Dead episode four. What episode are we on? What episode are we? Well, it's like been released most recently. Six. Okay. One was. Uh, no. Oh shit! Actually, I don't know. Five or six. I'm not sure.